President William Ruto has today ordered for prompt compensation of all farmers who bought fake fertilizer under the government fertilizer subsidy program. Speaking in West Pokot on Monday, President William Ruto castigated Kel Chemicals Limited for what he said was a clear attempt to sabotage the government's food security agenda. The directive comes three days after the Ministry of Agriculture revealed that three brands of fertilizer manufactured and distributed by Kel Chemicals failed to meet all the required tests parameters. And as Laura Tieno now reports, Ruto has called for the arrest and prosecution of all fake fertilizer dealers. After several weeks of mounting pressure on the head of state to declare himself on the issues around the distribution of fake fertilizer, <inaudible> President William Ruto has now ordered that all farmers who bought fake fertilizer consignments be compensated forthwith. Speaking in West Pokot County, President Ruto fingered manufacturer Kel Chemicals Limited, whose three brands of fertilizer were flagged by KEBS for failing to meet the requisite standards. Kuna company moja inaitua Kel sijui nini. Ni mesema awa watu, number one, kama kuna fertilizer mkulima amenunua na siyo correct, uyo mkulima lazima akue compensated, apatiwe fertilizer ingine free of charge. Na wakora wote, mambo yao ni matatu. Following a test analysis by quality watchdog KEBS, Kelfos Gold, Kelfos Plus and NPK 102610, manufactured and distributed by Kel Chemicals Limited, were found to not meet any of the required test parameters. The circular further indicated that the affected consignments were distributed between 5th and 10th of March 2024, advising all farmers to discontinue the use of the three brands and report to their nearest NCPB facilities for further guidance. The head of state vowing to crack the whip on all those involved in the fake fertilizer syndicate. Every farmer will get the correct fertilizer. Na wale watu wachache, wasababu kuna wakora ambao wanataka kuhujumu hiyo kazi ya muhimu ya kuzalisha chakula nilisema na narudia nikiwa hapa West Pokot si mambo ni matatu eh yeah. wakora wajipange President William Ruto had earlier today visited the NCPB store in Eldoret where he reassured farmers of the government's commitment to safeguard them from unscrupulous businessmen who are out to sabotage the government's food security agenda. The Kenya Bureau of Standards is set to take legal action against Kel Chemicals Limited for violating CAP 496 of the Standards Act by distributing substandard products. Mm -hmm. Citizen TV.